I'm in the process of mixing a song using only the UAD Essentials plugins, and I've got the UAD Sentry tube channel strip on pretty much every single track in this project, and I just need to dial in the vocal settings right now, so that's what I'm going to do in this video, so let's jump in. Now, very quickly, let's check out the song with and without the Sentry tube channel on all of the tracks. I just want to show you what it sounds like. I don't have the vocals enabled yet because they're not dialed in yet. Not too bad. So the Sentry Tube channel strip adds quite a bit of character to this song. It's extremely easy to dial in and that's what we're going to do right now. So this is just the default settings for the Tube channel strip. Let's listen to the vocal with all of this stuff off pretty much. Girl in love with a slasher girl. The way she moved really rocked my world. All right, so this vocal needs a lot of work. It needs EQ, it needs some compression and just some character added to it. So where I'm going to start is just with this tube preamp section right here. And I'm going to enable the high pass filter and I'm going to put the tube preamp into high. And what I'm gonna have to do now is watch my levels down here. I'm going to need to level match. So I'm just going to turn this down because I know it's going to be a little high. Girl in love with a slasher girl. The way she moved really rocked my world. And now she's running for her life. And I just... So right now we've just added the tube preamp. Now let's move on to the equalizer. And we just have to enable it. And I like to start with the lower bands. So right here, this is a low shelf. And I'm just going to listen and lower it until I like what I hear. Girl in love with a slasher girl. The way she moved really rocked my world. And now she's running for her life. And I just want to jump inside to save her. All right, so we don't need to roll off too much of the low end because we already have this high pass filter enabled here. And that's set to 80 hertz. And this low shelf is set to 110 hertz. So we've kind of got a lot of the stuff we don't want already rolled off. And this is just lowering everything else. Now let's go to our mid frequency here. And the way I like to do this is just kind of crank this up and then we'll scroll through the frequencies to see what we don't want. And because this EQ only has three frequencies, I'm going to focus more on the stuff I don't want as opposed to the stuff I do want with the mid range anyway. So let's just listen to this and scroll through the frequencies and see what we don't want. Girl in love with a slasher girl. The way she moved really rocked my world. And now she's running for her life. And I just want to jump inside to save her. All right, so I'm not really liking the stuff down here, and I'm just going to start to take it away and hear what we have. Girl in love with a slasher girl, the way she moved really rocked my world, and now she's running for her life, and I just want to jump inside to save her. All right, so I don't mind this so far. We might go back and change some of these things around once we listen to this in the mix, but now let's have a look at the high shelf and see what we can do with that, and I might want to increase this. Let's have a listen. Well, it took 20 minutes for me to get to know you. Then you ran off in the woods. You should have listened when they tried to warn you. All right, so not too bad. Let's move on to our compressor now. And let's see, this is the default setting here. Well, it took 20 minutes. So I want to get a little more aggressive with this. So well, it took 20 minutes for me to get to know you. Then you ran off in the woods. You should have listened when they tried to bore. All right. So now what we need to do is just level match this. And we'll do that by watching the meter. And we'll start with it off. So well, it took 20 minutes for... 
Only took 20 minutes for me to get to know you. Then you ran off in the woods. You should have listened when they tried to warn you. All right, so the levels are pretty much matched there now. So now let's check this out in the mix and see if there's anything we need to adjust. Didn't take long for her to realize something was wrong when they rocked. No one listened what she had to say. They just continued to party away. Didn't take long for her to realize something was wrong when they rocked. No one listened what she had to say. They just continued to party away. So I don't mind what I've just quickly dialed in right there. Obviously, you could spend a little more time with this. Where I think it's really limited is in the equalizer section. I would really like one more mid-frequency band in there. That would be excellent for this. The UAD Century Tube Channel Strip is really easy to work with and dial in. And this is just one of the plugins in the Essentials Bundle. If you want to check out the other plugins, click the video on the screen. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. For Audio Tech TV, I'm Zane. Keep creating. Fist bump. Thumbs up.